Okay, here's just another performance test. I'm testing rigid bodies and uh, particles at the same time, lots of them. So I can generate, so I was, it was reminded me of doing a condominium. I once went into, I went, flew down to Hurricane Wilma one time, and the condo I was staying in, the thing was, uh, was swaying back and forth. It was pretty awesome. So it actually was trying to make a swaying effect, but I couldn't quite get it. But there's, let me see, 1,623 faces, and there's each one. There's, oh, 276 cubes, 275 cubes, I guess, in here. And there was 1,000 particles, particles per cube. So quite a bit of stuff going on. We'll get rid of that so you can see it. There you go, that's better. And you can see how they separate towards the top. It was It's an interesting effect, actually. I put a static, or basically a passive plate, in one of the other videos on the top. And it kind of, hold, it kind of holds it there, and then they kind of start splaying out from the center instead of the top. So this, uh, this new integrated rigid body dynamic stuff is pretty cool. Okay, that's it for now. I'll see you in the next video.